morning to you. Welcome to the shave. Thank you, Mrs. H. Hey. Right. Very nice. So how are you doing? Welcome to Wednesday. That doesn't seem... Welcome to Wednesday. And a very mixed... Mix and match. And a, I'm using a EDT. I've never used on camera anyway before. Um, quite posh for me. So, razor of choice is this beautiful Gillette Fat Handle Tech in gold, in good condition. Now, there's no date codes on this. Um, so, I presume, uh, I think they started making, putting numbers on here for date codes for Gillette in 19... Uh, 51 I think up to 2001 um, so this must be a 1940s razor because it hasn't got the I'm sure it's a three piece non adjustable I have um, put some mineral oil on that uh, thread Just a, I always do it. Um, I don't know if you can see on this camera, but uh, there's no numbers on this. Usually, it'll have in each end here, sort of a B1 or a D3 or something like that. But uh, um, made in the USA, so that's that. That's the razor. We'll load that up in a minute on the camera. The brush of choice is the Yaki. 24mm Tuxedo Synthetic Knot in red. Lovely. Blade. I might use these for a while. Um, a Big Ben blade. A super stainless blade made by the Lord Company. And then we're going to use this. Thing. Oops, an easy. Making a right mess of it. Well, there's the lid. One of my favourite Taylor Road Bond Street scents, this grapefruit. Uh, when I first, well, when I first used it, I don't know if it first came out. Such a realistic scent. And that is beautiful. So I've taken a scoop out of there. Very windy out today, so if you can hear some noise and banging and clacking, that's what it is. And I've put a bit on the bottom there of the fine porcelain bowl. And uh, so that's it. Without further ado, hope you're okay. Having a great week. Good shaves if you have any. Thank you. And good, uh, good health, of course. So, bottom camera, and we'll uh, load the blade, and then we'll create the lather. I'm back to de shaving, back to my usual uh, safety net. And we've got a good bit there. So, see you in a minute.
So there we go. That's the blade loaded into the razor. And uh, it comes in a, a rigid, well, it's not an original case it comes in that razor. It's a, uh, it comes in a Gillette Aristocrat case. And it's in the, in the original condition, you know, it's, you can see it's been worn and really nice. It, it's as if it could tell a story. Um, that was Don Navy Gold, Don Roberts, thank you, sir. Hope you're well if you're watching. And uh, that'll do, look at that, peaked to perfection. Ah, oh, the centre, that's lovely. Okay, so we'll uh, wet the... Wet the face. Not going to use a pre shave today. We should be. We should be okay. Look at this. Hmm. The zest, the zesty. It's like you, you know, just cut a grapefruit open. Beautiful, nice for a morning shave. We used to. I'm going to have to do that again. Grapefruit. Yeah. Used to have half a grapefruit for breakfast. My, do you know my grandmother? My, Probably, sorry if I repeat myself, but when I do these things and scents and take me back to people and places and times, so when I remember, I seem to say it. And there was a, my grandmother used to cut a grapefruit in half before going to bed and uh, sprinkle sugar on it on each side, on each half, and place them in the fridge. And then by the time the morning come, all the sugar's gone into the fruit. Um, otherwise it'd be very, very sharp, bitter, uh, sour as we call it. But I don't mind that. And um, it was a lovely breakfast, yeah. So here we go, the Gillette Fat Handle Tech, three piece, non-adjustable, overhang to be aware of. And we're using a big blend, blend a big, there we go. Big Ben blade. We'll heat the razor up. Uh, super stainless, brand new. Here we go, first pass. On this Wednesday. It's quite a stormy day. Or maybe the last bits of it, because it started getting quite blustery last night. Now the blade's working okay, but I wouldn't say it's it's not as smooth or efficient as many other blades. It might be just this blade. Sometimes you can get a dud blade, but it's it's not um, dangerous, but it's just... Uh, yeah, it's... Uh, You should take it's quite uh how would I describe it? It feels quite rough compared. It's um got a feeling to it like it's been used about five times already. Um but even then a lot of razors, blades feel better than that. And I know I've used them before, 
and enjoy them. So it could be this. Could be just this blade. That's why it's good really to not judge a blade if you've never used one before and it's not very good. It could be that it's an odd blade. Uh, sometimes it just doesn't suit that razor for you. It could be all sorts of things. But yeah, it's good residual. Good residual. You yeah. having a shave today? Please do share if you are. Really lovely shaving cream. Eh? As I say, my favourite scent. And then I'd say the uh, the German Street Collection for sensitive skin. There's another, there's many really, they're good, but uh, those would be the, the favourites. It's keeping clean as well, across the growth. It is keeping clean. It's good to be back in control, something you're used to. But as I say, um, straight razors or shavettes are not really my thing. But I like, because I've got them, I like to use them. Be it not very well, but um, I got a good shave out of it. And that's all I want really. It's just, what up you But when as I say when you're used to this way of shaving, it's like riding a bike, you you just get hold of it and shave, but with one of them you have to think more of what you're doing when you're not used to it. It's not a it's not a type of razor to use if you're in a rush to catch the bus. What a lovely, refreshing scent. See that little mark? I caught that with a shave it. The last shave. Make sure that chin bit. Ah, yeah, so what's your plans today? Or oh, if you're watching <clears throat> later on, if you've been working, I hope you've had a good day. As good as they get, we're halfway through the week. That's a good thing, isn't it? Nearing uh, the weekend, if you are off on the weekend, time with your friends or your family or or just on your own if you like to do stuff, hobbies or whatever. Shaving, which I class as a hobby now, really enjoy it. And if you're new to this, it takes time and patience. It doesn't work overnight. You won't have your first shave, usually. And uh, It's all great, you know, it, takes, it is a learning curve. It takes a bit of patience, time. You're better when you've got time and you've got your time to yourself, especially. And learn different things and uh, practice. It's, uh, as many people will tell you, it is against the growth now. It is worth it in the end. But the only trouble is when you start enjoying it, like many of us,
down the rabbit hole of uh, Oh, that's a nice razor. Oh, that's a nice brush. Oh, I think I'll try that blade. Oh, that's a nice soap. Four mortgages later. That's a lovely scent of fresh. That's nice. Yeah, as I say, I've for this blade. I think it's just this blade because I've used these before Big Ben and they're nice I've, well they work for me uh, I wouldn't put them as my favorite blade but they work they've always worked well uh, but this one seems to be slightly on the rough rough side and that's not because it's new. I can just feel it's that type of blade. So it could be, as I say, the machine or whatever that made that particular one must have had a glitch or an off day. <laughs> but it's working, it's doing the job. And it's only. Peter. He's only got one more job to do. Three, two, one. Pick up time, baby. Yeah. And we can do some nice pickups now. Nice pickups. That's the sound you want. That's lovely. Oh, come on. You can actually hear how many, well, how much there is left, you know. I mean, you could get away with three passes and nobody would know. It's a, just like to get that. We'll use the residual slickness. That is nice. That's beautiful. Right, cold water rinse. Scent strength of that cream when you've lathered out the puck is about four. When you've lathered, 
I'd say it drops to about three, three and a half for me, but I can smell it. No, it's no, it's not overpowering sort of thing. Nice, and they gotta watch the cats with these because lilies are quite poisonous for cats if they go near them. So that's it. I'm very happy with that. So we'll go with them Humphreys Citrus. So there's a bit of a, not even a tinkle of stinging or nothing. It's uh, we're having grapefruit, we're having lime and lemon, whatever's in that. Very good. And I'm going to do the, I usually just put the aftershave on now or whatever the EDT, but I'm putting that on last because I want it to last. So we're going to go with some uh, limes and pony, pony, pomegranate from Edwin Jagger. They're um, moisturising aftershave lotion. Good stuff. Is there a cap in there? Oh no. Oh sorry, I thought it was a... It was, I see that red thing, I thought it was a th thing you had to pull out, but it's just... That's what it is. And there we go. That's how it's... That's how it's made, that's nice. Very smooth. Can certainly smell the... Lime. On the... Pomegranate, I've never smelled a, I've never smelled a pomegranate, I've only ever eaten them. I don't think they have much of a, well they have a flavour but it's quite mild for me. And it's a scent I'd never remember. But this has something with it, this lime, so that must be the pomegranate. That is nice. That is good stuff. So, we're going to head now So Ralph Lauren. Polo, I, this came in a box uh, with a miniature on this one and the big one. Beautiful, right, ready, spray on. And that's it, good, oh it's lovely that. We're good to go with a posh ending. So we've used Taylorville Bond Street Grapefruit Shaving Cream Excellent to lather, good slickness, good residual, um, good protection and a gorgeous scent. Very realistic. We've used the Yaki 24mm uh, synthetic, the Tuxedo Knot. Lovely brush uh, with the red resin handle. The fine porcelain bowl. The Big Ben Super Stainless Blade, brand new. Not very pleased with it. It's done a good job. Um, but in my, to me, it wasn't, didn't feel as good as a usual new blade. It felt a bit rough, a bit off, uh, but it was doing the job okay. Didn't have to swap it out. Um, didn't feel that bad, but not as good as uh, I've had from these before. So it must have been a bit of a duff blade, I expect. And then um, the Gillette Fat Handle Tech, beautiful three piece. Uh, razor in gold so they'll be stripped down now rinsed cleaned and dried and then Welsh water to rinse and then we've used Humphreys uh, citrus witch hazel face toner and we did it back to front didn't we so we used the Edwin Jacker limes and pomegranate moisturizing cream and then the Ralph Lauren polo in red EDT there that's lovely. So um, thank you for your company yet again. And uh, I was able to answer a few comments um, last Sunday, which was nice. I had the time and I like to sit down, read them and answer them as I go, which was lovely. Um, so apologize if I don't get back to them in every shave, but I do read them and I do really appreciate your time watching these and writing a comment. Um, so I'm very pleased, yeah, thanks very much. So look after yourselves, have some great shaves if you haven't any, and um, 
a great rest of the week and I'll see you on Sunday for the weekend shave. Look forward to seeing you. All the best and bye bye. Thank you.